Hello everyone. In this video, I am going to share some ideas about how to connect your website contact form with your email using PHP Mailer and SNDP. So in my local host, I already created a folder called new SNDP and I am going to create a contact form inside here. So I am going to create a new HTML file. Form.html. I created a HTML file and open in my code editor. I'm using Sublime Test and I'm copying the form code from my blog. I will give the blog link in the video description so you can also copy all the codes and you can download the entire code from my website. okay we created our form let's look how it's look like this is our form i didn't done any styling because you have to you can easily understand what exactly we need to make it happen okay so we have a name field and email field and a message field when we submit this and it will go to our email so now we have to create our action file like mail.php so for that i am opening my folder and if you are familiar with the composer uh, a dependency manager of php and if you if you know about that and you, you can install the PHP mailer the PHP mail dependency from that so I will show you how if you have this composer installed already you can open your command prompt or your Windows PowerShell anything if you are using the Windows 11 you can use the Windows terminal uh, by just right clicking and if you are using older version of Windows you can press and hold the shift key and right click and you can able to see open the powershell window here in my case i am using uh, windows terminal i am going to install the php mailer dependency and paste it here and press enter it will create a composer.json file and it will note that uh, we are installing the php mailer and once that complete we can see a folder created called vendor and a file created as composer.json and another one composer.log now we have to create our second file called mail.php you can see in the form action we set the target to mail.php that's why i created the file called mail.php now you have to back to my website and copy the mail.php source code i will explain everything in a little bit okay and uh, this is our uh, mail.php file and we are using the mail classes and we are at a, we are connecting uh, to our vendor autoload.php file and here we are receiving the data from our form uh, the name we are getting the name into this field and we are storing in name variable and here email and message and one after that we are we are making a single string from all this because we we have to send this single string as a mail content so I uh, store everything in one single variable message content okay here is our mailing configuration start if you are testing this you can uncomment the debug so you can see what is happening inside into it when you run the code okay here you have to set your SNDP host and 
SDP username and password. If you have uh, the inscription, and you have you have to uncomment this. Currently, I don't have the inscription, and you can add your SDP for for here. And here you can set the from email address, and here you can set uh, the two address and the two user uh, name, and if you want to add some another address you can also use here in our case we don't need and you can set the uh, reply address when uh, the user reply to the email it will went to here and you can add cc and bcc we don't need that if you have any attachment you can add that attachment file uh, here you just need to uh, give a path for this and this is a mail content if it's an HTML content you have to uh, add true if it's a plain test you can add false here and you can give the uh, mail subject and add test mail you can add anything and here in the mail body we are giving the content i mean all the details we collected from the form and once that email sent it will display this message message has been sent okay now in our case i am using the mail trap website to test my sndp here we can get a sample sndp credentials to check our sndp script so here i am going to find the php mailer and we can see uh, we got the integration here we already have uh, the SNDP host added mailtrap.io and the username is this and password is it okay I just changed my username and password also uh, the port is 2525 and SNDP auth true everything is seems perfectly fine so we have to test it okay I'm just refreshing this and add you. Yeah. okay you can see the message has been sent that message here okay when I am checking uh, my inbox inside the mail trap i can see that the mail is working and we can see our mail content here the name is ajit and email and message you may wondering what is this we enable the sndp debug here so that's why it's showing all the messages and all the logs and all the logs here if you don't want that you can just comment this line the SNDP debug and it won't will it won't display again when I submit once again you can only see the message has been sent that is which we displaying here also you can see the messages arrived yeah this is how it's work if you don't have uh, any experience with Composer uh, you don't need to worry uh, because you can download the entire source code from here okay so you just need to replace the SNDP credentials here and the uh, from address and to address also if you want to add more fields so you can add uh, here like mobile and we have we are going to add that in the form too just copying this okay 
okay you can see the mobile field here i'm going to test it you can see the mobile number so this is uh, uh, how the way you can make your form uh, with as many as fields you want thank you guys for watching this video and we'll see you in the next one